bad time in the game, brothers and when sisters, got their rights, and especially the women. <laughs> Marsha was very good-natured. She was funny. She laughed. But that shouldn't be mistaken for a lack of serious purpose and political intent. Her mission in life is going about spreading peace and goodwill, giving license to, you don't have to be dressed up in a suit. You can express yourself. She became, to me, like a bodhisattva, a holy person who would wander the village in whatever adornment she wanted, of being at peace. How will this affect your, your job? Hey. Darling, I don't have a job. I'm on welfare. I have no intention of getting a job as long as this country discriminates against homosexuals. I want to say it was the 4th of July. We were going to meet at midnight, but she never showed up. She was in danger. I was there when they pulled her out. Marsha was so full of life. Marsha P. Johnson was the Rosa Parks of the LGBT movement. Darling, I want my gay rights now! Her case has been cold for 25 years. I'm calling from the Anti-Violence Project here in New York City. I want to try to give Marsha justice. Marsha! Marsha! Street people and the drag queens were the vanguard of the movement. The Stonewall, Marsha and I fought the cops off. We were in the streets turning over cars. The movement started the next day. Marsha was famous all around the world. But even famous people, cases go cold. This is her case. It's hard for me to believe that she would commit suicide. A lot of people think it was a murder. Marsha had a fear about the mafia. Something's wrong. We keep on running into a brick wall. You a private investigator? No. Don't play detective yourself, all right? Leave this to the people that should handle it. We want justice here! To find out who the hell murdered Marsha! I have been beaten. I have been thrown in jail. I have lost my job for gay liberation. Revolution now! I don't bite my tongue for nobody, which can get you murdered, you know. The police just brush it off. I'll get to the bottom of it. There's a massive number of trans women who have been murdered. And they're yelling out from their graves. For justice.